strength, determination, commitment, and overcoming all obstacles to play the game that you love. Stars on three. One, two, three, four! Let's go, boys. Meet the Dallas Sled Stars. I played sports my whole life before I was injured, and uh, it was fantastic to get back out and be part of a team and get out and, and be physical. And this is one of the rare sports where it's extremely physical and a lot of contact, so I enjoy it. I was uh, 13, was riding a go-car and got hit by a car um, back home in Oklahoma. And so I did a bunch of rehab in Chicago and I tried hockey there as a camp, but then basketball is my main thing for, I don't know, about eight years. And then I found this and it's, it's a whole different, whole different community than basketball. Good job, guys. Really good. The Dallas Stars are constantly working to grow the game of hockey in Texas. And that means every form of the game. You see the rink is lined by kids and families that are really looking here going, wow, this, this is something I could try and I could do. And so much like, you know, we introduce programs like, you know, uh, Little Rookies, uh, we, we'd hope to extend that to a Sled Rookies program and, and really make it inclusive and able for young kids and families to participate in this sport. Dr. Pepper Star Center in Farmers Branch recently underwent modifications to install sled modified boards. As you can see, we have clear boards so that when they come off the ice, they can see through the boards. And to make that happen, the entire side of the rink had to be taken down and brought back up. And we had to do that with keeping all the activities happening on the rink so that we could keep the cost down and, and make it a manageable project. So um, it's, it's an awesome opportunity to have folks like this in our facility and to bring sled hockey to Dallas Community and Farmers Branch. Here we go. There's kind of a, a wow factor to it. Uh, it's a little different and you know people come into the rink and there's this transparency and all of a sudden you're bringing the outside in in a way and, and even for fans it's kind of a cool experience. This makes a world of difference for the guys on the ice. It helps keep the flow of the game going. Instead of having players outside on the boards, you can't get the cut caught up in them, and so it adds to a different flow, but and it just makes things run a lot smoother. On Super Bowl Sunday, the Dallas Sled Stars wrapped up a three-game tournament in which they hosted the Nashville Sled Preds and won two games to one. It's fantastic. Uh, it's the first time we've been able to bring in another team for a weekend, really, and have a tournament like this in a long time. It was the first test for their newly modified rink in Farmer's Branch. It was neat to see the rinks. We, uh, we heard that there was uh, the modifications made, so we we're excited to see it. And uh, it's a step in the right direction. It's one of the few rinks in the country uh, that had the zero entry bench and had the guys off the ice. Uh, normally we're on the ice, so it's good. It's a step in the right direction for the sport. Jamie Benn and Tyler Sagan even tried their hand at the sport back in 2014. Oh, I watched obviously when Jamie and Tyler were out a little while ago, and and they came off the ice, and that that really humbled them. Uh, you know, this is this is, you know, as Johnny Carson used to say, these guys probably have muscles in places I don't even have places. You have to work at it. Um, like I said, I'm, we're all exhausted. There's no doubt about that. While guys like Jamie and Tyler continue to inspire young hockey players at their games at the American Airlines Center, it's guys like Olympian Taylor Lipset. Mm. Mm. Hi. Hi. You hockey? Is it a hockey game? Yeah. Yeah, I think. Logan. It's made me stronger. Um, I like it. I really like working with the kids. That's my favorite part. Cody. Being out there in the rink makes me feel alive. And Cliff. For people that, especially I think we're walking before and we're athletes and then you get put in a chair from an injury or whatnot, to be able to have that, that team and that camaraderie that you did your whole life to come back to you. It does a lot for you personally, mentally. Who inspire the next generation of sled stars in Farmer's Branch. Whenever I was younger, I didn't really have anybody to look to um, whenever I got hurt. And so it kind of gives kids to say, hey, you're good. Like, you can figure it out. It's better, I promise. And then we can help them if they have any questions. I think that's the best part about it. Good job, man. Uh, you're good.